We got a customer, he's supposed to drop it off at the airport. This man gonna drop it off all the way back. A 30 minute drive away from the airport. Actually 45 minutes to be exact. He was a real one. He was like, do you guys need for me to come back over there and this and that? Cool guy, great guy. So you know what? We decided to get the car. Because I believe they're keeping the car for like four days. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> How you gonna fall? He pushed me, guy. <laughs> what? My arms are right here. That's some cat. Oh my god! <laughs> Swear, what's good with y'all? <laughs> I know y'all saw us in the hurt hotel. Oh my god! In that beat up hotel. Finally, we're back home. The hotel scene thing. I don't know what I'm trying to say here. Yeah, I got the broken lamp in there. Like, how's there a broken lamp? And there it was, was a, a hole. hole in the wall. <laughs> yeah. you know, we saying the same. Yeah, it was a hole on the wall. <sighs> broken lamp. The shower was. Oh my gosh. So we took a shower, right? And like, when I was about to get out, I was like, this isn't our soap, right? Because you know those. Oh, yeah, um, there was a piece of soap. <laughs> what are they called? Those soaps the that they soaps. leave for the. the yeah, that they leave for the guests. There was a oh, piece of the soap in the corner you, of the tub. That's how you know they ain't clean it. Yes, that's how we you were know. grossed out. <laughs> <sighs> they didn't have no antibacterial soap. They said, y'all could get. And they, they specifically said, like, oh, due to. We don't have breakfast in the mornings. But y'all don't got no soap in the bathroom. You left with a pimple and I left with a pimple. Mm-hmm. But we just wanted to update y'all on what happened. Oh my gosh. And bring it two extra blankets. One for the bed and one to cover yourself at night. Oh no. <laughs> no. It was a bad experience. Just go on Airbnb. It depends. Which it, depends. it depends. It depends. It depends. It depends. <laughs> the phone in the room didn't even work. Bro, like what really worked in there? Like the freaking light at the top was missing. Like it was gone. There was wires hanging. That was gone. Mm -hmm. the, like everything was like. Oh, the bathroom, the flush, 
the oh toilet. yeah the toilet didn't flush <laughs> oh wait let's let's get started with this shower the freaking uh when you turn the handle it turns on but you know what y'all when y'all pull that thing so the shower head can shoot yeah no nah, that ain't what happened i pulled that thing that hole where the water comes out it like pushed out and i'm like bro what the heck and there was water coming out of it and i had to like push it back in and then the shower head like pushed out water and i'm like bro this is this is bootleg this yeah. Never again. But that was what fifty four dollar a night hotel. You know, somebody's like, oh well, what did y'all expect? No, there's actually some nice fifty dollar hotels. Do not get it twisted. There actually is, but a lot. Most of the hotels they don't be cleaning their stuff though. Don't don't ever get it twisted. Yeah, and we had to stay in budget, so we went there obviously to drop off the car, like I mentioned. It didn't happen. We didn't drop off the car. <laughs> yeah, we actually didn't end up dropping the car, so we literally stayed in that hotel for nothing. Swear the charger drained the battery. We put that. We put it back in the, the Mustang. Yeah, it it didn't work. It wasn't working. It just was like, it's done. I had to jump start the car three times. Three times. Yeah. And three times because we drove the auto zone and then they were trying to charge us for two hundred dollars for a battery. Ridiculous. Then we left, went to Walmart, they ain't have it, so then guess what? We had to bring it back to auto zone. But guess what? Guess what? That was when the customer canceled on us and we're like, Oh bet. No. First we purchased the battery. We ended up buying the two hundred dollar battery. I know. Clap it up for the ridiculousness. But it was an emergency because that booking was in like wasn't 45 minutes or something. If there's a way that we can solve the issue, we're going to just solve the issue before canceling it. Thanks. I was installing the battery. I had the positive on the positive. I wasn't done yet. And then, and then it got break. <laughs> oh, it's going down now. Okay, yeah, he was installing it. Didn't complete the installation. He, we didn't turn on the car yet, obviously, because it wasn't fully installed. Oh, that looks fun. So, um, I was, and then we get the notification that the man canceled. So, I was like, babe, he just canceled. So, like, in that moment, it's like, dang, we did all that just so he could cancel. So, I was like, we gotta try to return this battery because... We didn't, we don't need it right now because we actually did have a warranty under the battery that was already in the car. Now somebody's going to say, so why didn't y'all just go to the battery yes. place where y'all had? Why didn't y'all just go there? Because we're by the airport and guess what? The place where we need to go is 30 minutes the other way. <laughs> and it wasn't even open at that time. Yeah, anyways. so ain't really had a choice. Yeah, we didn't have a choice in that moment. So we were like, okay, let's return this battery. Thank God they actually accepted it. So that made us feel like a hundred times better. Mm -hmm. Went to the place. They were finally open at that time. They told us that the battery that we had had a bad cell. Yep. How? We're not sure. Because right now the issue is we're not even sure what exactly is draining the battery we have a feeling that is being drained because even when it's sitting the battery seems to go down slowly not, with this new battery it's not the alternator we already got that tested so we're thinking it could be the speakers that we ended up installing possibly but we doubt it because we had the issue before, before so it's probably the drone it's probably the drone it's probably how they wired it i feel probably. like it's how they wired it i really probably. feel like it's how they wired that and that's why it's draining because nothing was wrong with that mustang until that thing got on there yeah it wasn't even it was sitting there for that, some time and that guy was kind of weird too yeah we did get a weird vibe from him like yeah, he was grumpy we like, did he didn't want to do it yeah, he, yeah, I don't know. But we do have an appointment with them coming up like in two weeks. So we'll keep y'all posted. Oh, yeah, that. we did make an appointment. That's right. I forgot about June 8th. That. Yep. But yeah, that's pretty much what happened. We took our butts home because we were tired. We were so tired. After that, we ate 
and then went home. I tried taking a nap. It didn't really happen. Babe, you took a short nap. I was in. God dang, bro. <laughs> Look like a ghost. Like. Oh, okay. Craziness. Some For all you customers who think it's so simple. It's not. It's not that simple. We be doing going through hoops just to make it fine for y'all. So mm. give give y'all host a break unless they are dicks and they're not trying to work with you. Yeah, and uh, let me just say he didn't cancel just for no reason. We actually told him so his plane actually arrived early, which was yep. not what we expected. And nope, it wasn't our like fault that the car wasn't going to be delivered until at the start of his trip because we had planned around the time of his start well, time. We were really supposed to. We usually drop it off an hour before or two at least in case of stuff like that. But since that battery happened, yeah. Yeah, so. Yeah, he didn't want to wait. Yeah, it was like 1030 <sighs> and we were still trying to, we were actually installing the battery, obviously. But um, we, I told him because hosts are also allowed 30 minutes after the trip start to make it to the pickup or drop off location wait pickup location yeah um so i told him like please allow 30 minutes after your trip start and he said he wasn't willing to wait and that's why he canceled which was understandable like his flight got there early and we did tell him that we would be there a little before 10:30. Because we didn't expect that the battery was going to die. Yeah. Because the plan was get a car wash and then go to the airport. But yeah, that's 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 what happened. I had to update y'all on that. Another learning experience. It's great. Yup, for sure. I mean, looking at it and learning from it, it's great to me. I'm not even being sarcastic about that. Like, I genuinely mean, like, it's great that we're learning these things. We appreciate y'all watching. <laughs> let us know down below if you experienced any type of things like this and let us know some of the things we can do on the channel to give y'all better content. But we gotta grind. And shine at, at the, the same, same dang time. time. Bye.